In particle physics, a lepton is an elementary particle of half-integer spin, spin one -half that does not undergo strong interactions. Two main classes of leptons exist, charged leptons also known as the electron-like leptons, and neutral leptons better known as neutrinos. Charged leptons can combine with other particles to form various composite particles such as atoms and positronium, while neutrinos rarely interact with anything, and are consequently rarely observed. The best known of all leptons is the electron. There are six types of leptons, known as flavors, grouped in three generations. The first generation leptons, also called electronic leptons, comprise the electron e and the electron neutrino nu e. the second are the munich leptons, comprising the muon mu minus and the muon neutrino, nm and the third are the taonic leptons, comprising the tau, tau minus and the tau neutrino. And electrons have the least mass of all the charged leptons. The heavier muons and taus will rapidly change into electrons and neutrinos through a process of particle decay, the transformation from a higher mass state to a lower mass state. Thus electrons are stable and the most common charged lepton in the universe, whereas muons and taus can only be produced in high-energy collisions such as those involving cosmic rays and those carried out in particle accelerators. Leptons have various intrinsic properties, including electric charge, spin, and mass. Unlike quarks however, leptons are not subject to the strong interaction, but they are subject to the other three fundamental interactions, gravitation, the weak interaction, and to electromagnetism, of which the latter is proportional to charge, and is thus zero for the electrically neutral neutrinos. For every lepton flavor there is a corresponding type of antiparticle, known as an antilepton, that differs from the lepton only in that some of its properties have equal magnitude but opposite sign. According to certain theories, neutrinos may be their own antiparticle. It is not currently known whether this is the case. The first charged lepton, the electron, was theorized in the mid-19th century by several scientists and was discovered in 1897 by J. J. Thomson. The next lepton to be observed was the muon, discovered by Carl D. Anderson in 1936, which was classified as a meson at the time. After investigation, it was realized that the muon did not have the expected properties of a meson, but rather behaved like an electron, only with higher mass. It took until 1947 for the concept of leptons as a family of particle to be proposed. The first neutrino, the electron neutrino, was proposed by Wolfgang Pauli in 1930 to explain certain characteristics of beta decay. It was first observed in the cowan rhinus neutrino experiment conducted by Clyde Cowan and Frederick Rhinus in 1956. The muon neutrino was discovered in 1962 by Leon M. Lederman, Melvin Schwartz, and Jack Steinberger, and the tau discovered between 1974 and 1977 by Martin Lewis Pearl and his colleagues from the Stanford Linear Accelerator Center and Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory. The tau neutrino remained elusive until July 2000, when the donut collaboration from Fermilab announced its discovery. Leptons are an important part of the standard model. Electrons are one of the components of atoms, alongside protons and neutrons. Exotic atoms with muons and taus instead of electrons can also be synthesized, as well as lepton antilepton particles such as positronium. Etymology The name lepton comes from the Greek leptos leptos, fine, small, thin. Neuter nominative, accusative singular form, lepton lepton, the earliest attested form of the word is the Mycenaean Greek, repotu, written in linear B-syllabic script. Lepton was first used by physicist Leon Rosenfeld in 1948, following a suggestion of Professor. C. Mahler, I adopt as a pendant to nucleon. The denomination lepton from leptos, small, thin, delicate to denote a particle of small mass. The etymology incorrectly implies that all the leptons are of small mass. When Rosenfeld named them, the only known leptons were electrons and muons, whose masses are indeed small compared to nucleons. The mass of an electron, 0.511 MeV C2, and the mass of a muon with a value of 105.7 MeV C2 are fractions of the mass of the heavy proton, 938.3 MeV C2. 
However, the mass of the tau discovered in the mid 1970s, 1777 MeV C2 is nearly twice that of the proton and about 3500 times that of the electron. Topic: History The first lepton identified was the electron, discovered by J.J. Thomson and his team of British physicists in 1897. Then in 1930 Wolfgang Pauli postulated the electron neutrino to preserve conservation of energy, conservation of momentum, and conservation of angular momentum in beta decay. Pauli theorized that an undetected particle was carrying away the difference between the energy, momentum, and angular momentum of the initial and observed final particles. The electron neutrino was simply called the neutrino, as it was not yet known that neutrinos came in different flavors or different generations. Nearly 40 years after the discovery of the electron, the muon was discovered by Carl D. Anderson in 1936. Due to its mass, it was initially categorized as a meson rather than a lepton. It later became clear that the muon was much more similar to the electron than to mesons, as muons do not undergo the strong interaction, and thus the muon was reclassified. Electrons, muons, and the electron neutrino were grouped into a new group of particles the leptons. In 1962, Leon M. Lederman, Melvin Schwartz, and Jack Steinberger showed that more than one type of neutrino exists by first detecting interactions of the muon neutrino which earned them the 1988 Nobel Prize, although by then the different flavors of neutrino had already been theorized, the tau was first detected in a series of experiments between 1974 and 1977 by Martin Lewis Pearl with his colleagues at the SLAC LBL group. Like the electron and the muon, it too was expected to have an associated neutrino. The first evidence for tau neutrinos came from the observation of missing energy and momentum in tau decay, analogous to the missing energy and momentum in beta decay leading to the discovery of the electron neutrino. The first detection of tau neutrino interactions was announced in 2000 by the Donut Collaboration at Fermilab, making it the latest particle of the standard model to have been directly observed, apart from the Higgs boson, which has been discovered in 2012. Although all present data is consistent with three generations of leptons, some particle physicists are searching for a fourth generation. The current lower limit on the mass of such a fourth charged lepton is 100.8 GeV, C2, while its associated neutrino would have a mass of at least 45.0 GeV, C2. Topic: <laughs> Properties. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Spin and chirality. Leptons are spin one-half particles. The spin statistics theorem thus implies that they are fermions and thus that they are subject to the Pauli exclusion principle. No two leptons of the same species can be in exactly the same state at the same time. Furthermore, it means that a lepton can have only two possible spin states, namely up or down. A closely related property is chirality, which in turn is closely related to a more easily visualized property called helicity. The helicity of a particle is the direction of its spin relative to its momentum. Particles with spin in the same direction as their momentum are called right handed and otherwise they are called left handed. When a particle is massless, the direction of its momentum relative to its spin is frame independent, while for massive particles it is possible to overtake the particle by a Lorentz transformation flipping the helicity. Chirality is a technical property defined through the transformation behavior under the Poincaré group that agrees with helicity for approximately massless particles and is still well defined for massive particles. In many quantum field theories, such as quantum electrodynamics and quantum chromodynamics, left and right-handed fermions are identical. However, the standard model's weak interaction, treats left-handed and right-handed fermions are asymmetrically, only left-handed fermions and right-handed anti-fermions participate in the weak interaction. This is an example of parity violation explicitly written into the model. In the literature, left-handed fields are often denoted by a capital L subscript e.g. the normal electron, L- and right-handed fields are denoted by a capital R subscript e.g. a positron or plus. 
Right-handed neutrinos and left-handed anti-neutrinos have no possible interaction with other particles see sterile neutrinos and so are not a functional part of the standard model, although their exclusion is not a strict requirement, they are sometimes listed in particle tables to emphasize that they would have no active role if included in the model. Even though electrically charged particles electron, muon, or tau do not engage in the weak interaction specifically, they can still interact electrically, and hence still participate in the combined electro-weak force, although with a different strengths <laughs> Electromagnetic interaction One of the most prominent properties of leptons is their electric charge, Q. The electric charge determines the strength of their electromagnetic interactions. It determines the strength of the electric field generated by the particle see Coulomb's law and how strongly the particle reacts to an external electric or magnetic field see Lorentz force. Each generation contains one lepton with Q equals minus E conventionally the charge of a particle is expressed in units of the elementary charge and one lepton with zero electric charge. The lepton with electric charge is commonly simply referred to as a charged lepton while the neutral lepton is called a neutrino. For example, the first generation consists of the electron E- with a negative electric charge and the electrically neutral electron neutrino nu E. In the language of quantum field theory, the electromagnetic interaction of the charged leptons is expressed by the fact that the particles interact with the quantum of the electromagnetic field, the photon. The Feynman diagram of the electron-photon interaction is shown on the right. Because leptons possess an intrinsic rotation in the form of their spin, charged leptons generate a magnetic field. The size of their magnetic dipole moment mu is given by mu equals G Q four M display style mu equals G frac Q H B A R four meters, where M is the mass of the lepton and G is the so-called G factor for the lepton. First order approximation quantum mechanics predicts that the G factor is two for all leptons. However, higher order quantum effects caused by loops in Feynman diagrams introduce corrections to this value. These corrections, referred to as the anomalous magnetic dipole moment, are very sensitive to the details of a quantum field theory model and thus provide the opportunity for precision tests of the standard model. The theoretical and measured values for the electron anomalous magnetic dipole moment are within agreement within eight significant figures. <laughs> Weak interaction In the standard model, the left-handed charged lepton and the left-handed neutrino are arranged in doublet nu L, e -L that transforms in the spinner representation T. Topic: <laughs> one half of the weak isospin SU gauge symmetry. This means that these particles are eigenstates of the isospin projection T3 with eigenvalues one half and minus one half respectively. In the meantime, the right-handed charged lepton transforms as a weak isospin scalar T 0 and thus does not participate in the weak interaction, while there is no evidence that a right-handed neutrino exists at all. The Higgs mechanism recombines the gauge fields of the weak isospin SU and the weak hypercharge U symmetries to three massive vector bosons W+, W-, Z0 mediating the weak interaction, and one massless vector boson, the photon, responsible for the electromagnetic interaction. The electric charge Q can be calculated from the isospin projection T3 and weak hypercharge YW through the gelman nishijima formula Q Topic T three plus one half Y W T O recover the observed electric charges for all particles. The left-handed weak isospin doublet nu L e minus L must thus have Y W minus one, while the right-handed isospin scalar e minus R must have Y W equals minus two. The interaction of the leptons with the massive weak interaction vector bosons is shown in the figure on the left equals topic mass 
equals in the standard model each lepton starts out with no intrinsic mass the charged leptons ie the electron muon and tau obtain an effective mass through interaction with the higgs field but the neutrinos remain massless for technical reasons the masslessness of the neutrinos implies that there is no mixing of the different generations of charged leptons as there is for quarks this is in close agreement with current experimental observations however it is known from experiments most prominently from observed neutrino oscillations, that neutrinos do in fact have some very small mass, probably less than 2 electron volts, C2. This implies the existence of physics beyond the standard model. The currently most favored extension is the so-called seesaw mechanism, which would explain both why the left-handed neutrinos are so light compared to the corresponding charged leptons, and why we have not yet seen any right-handed neutrinos. Equals. Topic. Leptonic numbers Equals. The members of each generation's weak isospin doublet are assigned leptonic numbers that are conserved under the standard model. Electrons and electron neutrinos have an electronic number of Le equals 1, while muons and muon neutrinos have a munic number of L mu. Topic. 1, while tau particles and tau neutrinos have a tauonic number of L tau. 1. The antileptons have their respective generations leptonic numbers of minus 1. Conservation of the leptonic numbers means that the number of leptons of the same type remains the same, when particles interact. This implies that leptons and antileptons must be created in pairs of a single generation. For example, the following processes are allowed under conservation of leptonic numbers E minus plus E plus gamma plus gamma Tau minus plus tau plus Z0 plus Z0, but not these Gamma E minus plus mu plus W minus E minus plus end Z0 mu minus plus tau plus, however, neutrino oscillations are known to violate the conservation of the individual leptonic numbers. Such a violation is considered to be smoking gun evidence for physics beyond the standard model. A much stronger conservation law is the conservation of the total number of leptons L, conserved even in the case of neutrino oscillations, but even it is still violated by a tiny amount by the chiral anomaly. <laughs> Universality The coupling of the leptons to gauge bosons are flavor independent i.e., the interactions between leptons and gauge bosons are the same for all leptons. This property is called lepton universality and has been tested in measurements of the tau and muon lifetimes and of Z boson partial decay widths, particularly at the Stanford Linear Collider and Large Electron Positron Collider experiments. The decay rate gamma gamma of muons through the process mu minus e minus plus nu e plus nm is approximately given by an expression of the form see muon decay for more details gamma mu minus e minus plus nu e plus nu mu equals k 1 g F two M mu five display style gamma left mu caret right arrow e caret plus bar new underscore e plus new underscore mu right equals k underscore one g underscore f caret two M underscore mu caret five, where k one is some constant and g f is the Fermi coupling constant. The decay rate of tau particles through the process tau minus e minus plus nu e plus n is given by an expression of the same form gamma tau minus e minus plus nu e plus nu tau equals k two g f 2 m tau 5 
display style gamma left tau caret right arrow e caret plus bar new underscore e plus new underscore tau right equals k underscore two g underscore f caret two m underscore tau caret five, where k two is some constant. Muon Tan universality implies that k one equals k two. On the other hand, electron muon universality implies gamma tau minus e minus plus new e plus new tau equals gamma tau minus mu minus plus new mu plus new tau Display style gamma left tau carrot right arrow e carrot plus bar new underscore e plus new underscore tau right equals gamma left tau carrot right arrow mu carrot plus bar new underscore mu plus new underscore tau right. This explains why the branching ratios for the electronic mode 17.85% and Munich 17.36% mode of tau decay are equal within error. Universality also accounts for the ratio of muon and tau lifetimes. The lifetime of a lepton tau is related to the decay rate by tau equals b minus e minus plus new E plus new gamma minus E minus plus new E plus new Display style tau underscore L equals FRAC B left L carrot right arrow E carrot plus bar new underscore E plus new underscore L right gamma left L carrot right arrow E carrot plus bar new underscore E plus new underscore L right where B x y and gamma display style gamma x y denotes the branching ratios and the resonance width of the process x y. The ratio of tau and muon lifetime is thus given by tau 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 mu equals b tau minus e minus plus new e plus new tau b mu minus E minus plus new E plus new mu M mu M tau five Display style FRAC tau underscore tau tau underscore mu equals FRAC B left tau carrot right arrow E carrot plus bar new underscore E plus new underscore tau right B left mu carrot right arrow E carrot plus bar new underscore E plus new underscore mu right left FRAC M underscore mu M underscore tau right carrot five Using the values of the 2008 review of particle physics for the branching ratios of muons and tau yields a lifetime ratio of approximately 1.29 times 10 minus 7, comparable to the measured lifetime ratio of approximately 1.32 times 10 minus 7. The difference is due to K1 and K2 not actually being constants, they depend on the mass of leptons. Recent tests of lepton universality in B meson decays, performed by the LHCb, Babar and Bell experiments, have shown consistent deviations from the standard model predictions. However the combined statistical and systematic significance is not yet high enough to claim an observation of new physics. <laughs> Table of leptons See also Coid formula List of particles Prions – hypothetical particles which were once postulated to be subcomponents of quarks and leptons <laughs>